Well, that was close. Aiden, more renegades on the lower level.
I'm on my way. One, two. Drop him. One move and he dies. Drop him. Aiden, watch. <laughs> Everyone, all right? Check who needs help and bring in some medics. And make sure there's no more of those fucking renegades in the area. Yes, Commander. You. You all right, boy? Jack, man. Come on, Frank. You all right? I saw you fight. What's your name? Aiden. If it weren't for you, a lot more would be dead. Come on, boys. Search the area. Sir, I have a question. We're looking for a GRE database. Most GRE equipment has been dead for years. What do you need this database for? With your knowledge of the city, you know GRE places inside out. Aiden and I need to find this database. Will you help us? Luan, he's your friend. <laughs> Aiden? You could say that. I've never heard of you, Aiden. Where are you from? I'm a pilgrim. I came from outside the walls. So you've seen a lot. You probably came through old Villador too, right? All right. What do you want to know? A lot has been going on there lately. We lost our commander, and the Bazarians tried to cut off our power source. They say most of our people have been killed, either by the infected or by those from the bazaar. I also lost contact with the new commander, Aitor, and his unit. Know anything about them? We found Walt, but he overpowered us and escaped. What? Where? In the tunnels, near the car plant. Walt's decimated Aider's squad. I, I barely managed to escape. I shouldn't have left them like this. We need to find out what's going on there. As for the GRE equipment you're asking about, you can ask Lieutenant Rowe. If something's working, he'll know about it. Lately, he and his unit have been securing the Culver Island and New Dawn Park areas. But because of the butcher's raid, we had to go radio silent. So you have to look for him yourselves. If you find him, give him these. What are they? Orders for him and the other units. Move it, boys. Let's go. Come outside. Let's talk.
Stray rocket hit a rooftop school nearby. Luckily, it was empty at the time. Belgram, Aiden, you gotta do something about this, sense. right? It doesn't make sense. Where did you learn to fight like that? Where? On the road? As a pilgrim? I had no other choice. On the road? <laughs> Don't you wonder sometimes what they gave us to make us like this? Stronger? Rather, fucked in the head. But yeah, fucked up and stronger. Maybe I'll figure that out when I find Mia. What's next? Well, you heard it yourself. Ro might know where you can access that damn database. Here, take these orders to him. Just don't lose them, or Jack will gut me. What about you? I'll join you. But first, I have to see Frank. You saw him. He's barely holding it together. So, uh, Frank, he's not exactly the most reliable source of help. You don't know what you're talking about. He was a night runner. Even though these days, he can't even say the name properly when he's drunk. Aren't the night runners ancient history? History can repeat itself. For good and for bad. Legends can't. Say what you want. I believe that when the time comes, if the time comes, Frank will rise to the occasion. Who knows? Maybe he'll even invite me to join the club. What about this Roe guy? You know him? Roe? Too fucking well I do. He's a great commander. And a fucking hothead. For some reason, people say we have a lot in common. Once, Jack sent his squad to a spot that turned out to be a dark zone. People panicked. And they probably wouldn't have made it out of there. But Roe kept his cool makes them all back out and suddenly starts banging a stick on some barrels attracting the motherfuckers it was a suicidal plan but the vital thing was it was a plan that's what makes soldiers think clear again if the night runner still existed frank would have recruited him for sure and jack the commander do you trust him jack matt he's a smart guy but a bit of a narcissist. What do you mean? Well, he's only a major, but refers to himself as Commander-in-Chief. But he gave us Rose location, and a chance to find the GRE terminal. I don't care about the rest. Okay. Good. Start with Culvert Island. The PK have an outpost there. Hey, Luan. You should know that in Old Villador, I, I came into conflict with Ader. I blew up the Peacekeeper's windmill, and we really don't like each other. <laughs> Are you afraid they'll figure out what you've done? Didn't you hear what Jack was saying? Take it easy. Nobody has contact with old Villador here. And even if there was someone, by that time, <laughs> we'll have already found what we're looking for. And stay on the radio all the time. Sure thing, partner. sure pissed off the renegades this time this will bring trouble for sure the best fighters gather at carnage hall how in the blue blazes did renegades get all the way here some civilian must have betrayed us How you doing, pal? They haunt me, you know. Dave, whose legs I watched get torn off by a volatile. Edgar, all of them. 
But the real pest is Ravik. <laughs> I was pissed when he took Akon's side. But then the bastard showed up anyway. <laughs> Stupid kid. Let's talk about something else. Yeah. <laughs> so, been thinking. Maybe it's time I joined you, you know. Huh? Frank, lay off the bottle. You reek. Don't like the stink? Then leave, Killian. I can't watch you do this anymore. Then close your eyes. Huh? Can you see them? Dave, Edgar, Ravik, man, that other kid. What's his name? He, he wasn't Night Runner material. Anton. You were right about him, but not about the mission. Would have been fine if we got in together. Then we'd all be dead. Shut up! Remember what I said? By doing this, we agree to die. There are more important things than living, huh? <laughs> Not everyone will understand it. They don't have to. <laughs> we face dead solemnly. This is the way from darkness to light. <sighs> Load of fucking garbage. Frank, get over yourself. And Ravik. What's done is done. Out of my fucking face, Killian. I never want to see you again. I'm a moron. Fucking moron.
cat dragged in. Well, don't look all butthurt. Hell, I want to thank the cat, because you look just like the kind of guy who could help me out. Name's Harper. Used to be a night runner a few lifetimes ago, it seems. And while this city has gone straight to hell, that don't mean I gave up being its guardian angel. And right now, we got us a problem. It's called electricity. Where everyone else sees a brave new world, I see the end of the world. I've been paying attention. Suddenly, all these new infected are popping up. You ask me, it's because of the electricity. Of course, it's only a hunch right now, but if I had tissue samples from the infected, bet I could figure out what's up with all these new ones. I've got some setup to do here. You think you can help me by collecting the tissue samples I need? And I'm talking fresh meat, my friend. Watch yourself out there, you hear? Don't push yourself too hard. I need you alive to bring back those samples. You shall receive, baby cakes. What the heck? Why not? Ooh, you know just what to bring, honey. Feel free to bring me more of those. Why, thank you, honey. I wanted one of those. Always in the market for those. And here was I worried about running out. How'd 
you know I was after that? Phew, cause I just sold my last darned one. You're a mind reader, baby cakes. I know that's right. Pleasure haggling with you, honey. Low price ain't nothing I won't sell you, honey. Why, that came just in time. A pleasure, honey. Top quality. You'll see how much better my stuff is in no time. That'll never fail you. <laughs> That'll take you to new levels. That's some good shit right there. You sure can rely on that. See how much better my stuff is? Okul dokul. Nice. Will you look at that? Powerful stuff, hombre. Pleasure doing business with your friend.
on. I'm nearing Culvert Island. Great. Frank sorted out, so I'm on my way. If you get Roe to tell you where the terminal is, let me know. You'll find your sister. I'll find the missing names of assholes for my kill list. Everyone will be happy. Except the people you shoot. They won't be in any condition to care. Lieutenant Rowe, I have orders from the commander. I ain't Rowe. He went off with a squad to New Dawn Park. I'm Lieutenant Grady. Great. Guess I gotta keep going. What are you talking about? Show me those orders, son. I was supposed to give them directly to Rowe. And I'm Rowe when Rowe's not here. It's called chain of command. Give him. What the hell? Did the commander say why we're being pulled back to center? He didn't seem too eager to explain anything to me. I'm just the messenger. Okay, boys, time to pack it in. Command's ordered us to withdraw. It's back to base for us. We're doing what? We're leaving this outpost? Don't question me. You can't hide behind Meyer's skirt out here. You're... you're abandoning us? W what do we do? We'll be defenseless. Go arm the survivors. Then we roll. Hey, if I were you, I'd give them plenty of weapons. The renegade sent a whole detachment to the fisheye. Any other bright ideas, civilian? Uh, just a question. Where can I find Roe? New Dawn Park, like I said. Not sure if they made it yet. You take these to him and tell him I'm on it. I'm better you than me, buddy. Roe's gonna blow his top when he reads these. And I'm here to save lives, not lose mine. Yeah, thanks for the tip. Assholes. We won't stand a chance. I'm really sorry, civilian, but we have orders. You can't leave us. If the renegades come, we'll be dead within a day. Easy there, civilian. We'll arm you. Arm us? Old men and women? All the youngsters have already joined the PK. Not much I can do, civilian. Now move. What if I don't? Will you strike a defenseless man? Might as well just kill us before you leave. Save the renegades the trouble. I said move. 